Hey, hey, welcome to Terranel Designs. I'm Sam Nelson, and each week we redesign an outdoor living space to match the individual style and needs of a homeowner. I'll walk you through my design process and get you some tips along the way. If you find this video helpful, please take a minute to hit like and subscribe. That really helps. And if you're looking to redesign your outdoor living space, head on over to our website, terranelldesigns.com, and click Get Started. All right, let's get to it. Today's design, we have basically a blank slate. It's a new construction home. They have a builder special. So it's just about like a 12 by 10 patio of concrete, just brushed concrete in the backyard. And it's just sod. Uh, they do have a privacy fence uh, currently, but other than that, they really don't have a lot going on back there. Now, because it's a new development, they get full sun. There's not really any old trees. Um, they are getting sun pretty much all day, so they want a little space to get a break from that. And they love to entertain, so they want really like a nice outdoor kitchen area. They have a ton of grills, and they really want to incorporate that into like a custom bar. Let's take a look at the design, and then we'll chat about it. We'll kick it off by talking about the pavilion. So this roof structure is going to attach to the house. It's going to have a finished tongue and groove ceiling with a fan as well as some recessed lighting. So killer space to entertain and it definitely is going to give them a break from the sun and also allow them to still be outside when it's raining. Under the pavilion we have a custom outdoor kitchen. So we have a fridge, we have a garbage can, we have room for their two grills and their two smokers. So just like a killer space to be able to really show off your grill master skills. Out from under the pavilion, we have a fire pit area, including a seat wall. We changed the pavers up so we have a little bit of a different style here. Now this is a wood burning fire pit. So we want to make sure that it's a certain distance from the house. Every town has a different uh, setback to make sure that we don't have embers flying at your house. Of course, we want to make sure it's safe. The landscaping in this design is going to be pretty simple. Since they already have a privacy fence, we don't need any big like arborvitaes or evergreen style plants to really block the neighbors. We just want to kind of soften it up so it's not like grass running straight into a you know PVC vinyl fence. So we want to bring uh, bring the beds out without encroaching too much on some of the remaining green space since we don't have a huge yard to work with. All right, well that wraps it up for this week. Hope you guys found some value from this video. If so, please take a minute to hit like and subscribe. That really helps. If you have any questions or requests on videos that you'd like to see in the future, please let me know in the comments below. If you're looking to kick your backyard up a notch, head on over to our website, terranelldesigns.com and click get started. Until next week, I'm Sam and this is Terranel Designs.